we are back. And this time not with Super Mario 3D World, but with Bowser's Fury. So interesting, you can see at the bottom, for one of four players, including local wireless and online multiplayer, and Bowser's Fury is just one or two local players. And I am very excited, because this is essentially the new Mario game we're getting. This is the main Mario studio that just made this. This isn't like a secondary studio. This is the guys who made Odyssey. This is the guys who made Galaxy. So this is the next mainline Mario, but they it's a smaller package. It's not like a full lane, but they put it as a bonus to the other game. But this is something we could expect, and I'll, I've been seeing a lot of stuff about it online, and I'm actually very excited to play this. I think it, it actually innovates on the, on the series in ways that we haven't seen Mario do before, and you'll see what I mean. So, nice little Mario running as a loading screen. I kind of prefer the original color style of Mario for that sprite. Where it was inverted colors. Right. Let's watch this. I have not seen this, so really excited. Sunshine. So it's interesting because they did that intro in very much the Mario 3D world style where you're seeing them from a perspective and then he falls into a fully 3D world which this is. So that's really cool. Oh interesting. It doesn't let me look up or down but side to side. Alright. So before we go any further, there is something special. Oh wait, I forgot to change the title. There is something special I want to do with this. And it will be reflected in the... I would like... to... count... I would like to count all of the cats. Everything is cat-themed, but is everything cat-themed? And how many things are there? that are cat theme. I can see two already on screen. So, welcome in our cat count. We will have a little cat count. So right now I see two. I see the bushes, and I see the flowers. The flowers are cat paws, the bushes have cat ears. But we have two. We'll see. We'll see how that goes. Much better than counting Luigi. You got it. All right, so let's let's go through here. But yeah, this game has oh oh. Why is there ship crashed here? Oh oh. The signs are themed like cats. <laughs> That's what I noticed. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh no. Oh no. Uh oh. Uh oh. Ma Mario, this is no time to wall jump. Make the lighthouse shine. Lighthouse is also themed. So we have two more. Signs and Lighthouse. Oh, oh, he has a help. Also, I think this is the darkest we've ever seen Bowser. Like, Bowser's always kind of like, Oh, I'm the bad guy, but I'm not really that mean. Oh, look at that sprite. 
That's a cool spray. That's a really bad spray. Ooh. Ooh, I'm liking the music. I'm liking the music. Help? Is that Junior? Alright, so we're adding two more to the counter. Four. We have four things. Oh, I didn't add trees. Five. <laughs> oh, new game. How was that? Eh, it was all. Was, wait, is the bird cat theme? Is the bird cat theme? <laughs> yes. <laughs> the bird. <laughs> How do I zoom? Six on the cat counter. It was alright, but I'm honestly very much more excited about this because this is an actual new Mario game that we're getting to experience. And the interesting thing is, is that it's made in the in the 3D World engine, which is very interesting. So it retains a lot of the things from 3D World, but it's fully 3D now. It's not like that semi 3D uh, 3D world boy. What's up, Junior? Okay, Bowser. Mm hmm Went crazy with goop. Is this your doing? You're the one with a paintbrush. Did he paint him black and then he became evil? It looks like Bowser Jr.'s in trouble. Mario. Mario! No, that's Mario! I don't. Mario! Daddy's out of control! I don't know what happened! Hmm. I tried to help him, but he's too big and mad! Can't change that back by myself. Mario's not convinced. Mario's like, you did this, kid. I know you. I never ask you for help, ever, ever. But I'll do anything to save Papa. Oh, help me, Murray. Hmm. Hmm. Seems like you're suffering a lot. <laughs> I guess I'll help. <laughs> You've teamed up with Bowser Jr. But how much should he help you? Uh, help a little, a lot, none, little. You've asked for Bowser Jr. to help a little. Change settings. Here's one more thing to mention. If you share two Joy-Con controllers, a second person can play as Bowser Jr. You can select two-player mode. Okay. So one thing I, I did want to mention about this game is that... Cat Goomba. Um, it also... A lot of people are saying this could have been a DLC for... Um, Odyssey. And what's the only theme that Odyssey didn't go to the only location? Sunshine. And this actually calls back a lot of sunshine related things. Like Junior with the, the thing, a lot of paint themes. Even the Junior's paint logo at the beginning, it's all from Sunshine. So a lot of people thought that maybe this was just a mode that never got... Uh, do we count this? I don't think this has a non-cat counterpart, so I think this is... So, here's a big new change that this game has for, uh... for the Mario formula. And you might not be able to notice this per se just from this beginning. Junior! Okay, I don't want Junior helping me. Oh wait, I kind of do. Just for the secrets, though. I want him to help me less, but I, I, I want him to tell me where the secrets are. But he's helping me a little bit too much. Uh, so this is all one big seamless world. Oh, 
Bowser Jr., please help me! They think I'm a cat! Oh no! Oh no, they're following me, Bowser Jr. Oh. Will they run? Ah, oh, they're following me! Ah. Oh, Bowser Jr., did you just hit them? Okay, okay, kitties, kitties. Follow me, follow me. Stop bopping them! Okay, I'm, I'm turning off Bowser Jr. I don't want none of that help. I don't want you bopping my cats. Stop bopping my cats! You keep bopping the cats! Yeah, I'm a mom kid. Oh, oh! What's up, buddy? Oh, no. <laughs> okay. Are there any other- I won't- Okay, so I'm counting up all the cat stuff. And I'm actually gonna move the cat counter, because I didn't know exactly where stuff would be. Uh... Uh, I'm moving the cat counter here. I'm actually gonna add a... an outline. Just code. There we go. So, should we count this sign as a different point on cat counter? Or should it be the same as the first sign? The death sign? I guess we could consider- oh, rain! So it seems like I'm taking Bowser down pretty quickly though. So he's turtling again. Oh, he fully submerges. So I guess I can look at I can count and look at this guy. That actually happened pretty quickly. I wonder if it always happens that quick. The lighthouse wants to bring something to light. That splotchy goop will vanish under the light of a cat shunt. But some of those cat shanks are a bit shy. If you can't find one, try looking on another island. Islands with lighthouses are usually hiding something. Get to a high up spot and whatever. Oh, whoops, I need to do that. It, it's in interesting, this is the se I feel like more than any other Mario game, this one has been, okay, we, we could go up there. What's the map like? Oh, this is almost like... Like, uh... Breath of the Wild. Where you have... Kind of... Ooh. So... This, more than any other Mario game, has spawned... Um... Uh, games and, like, ideas I mentioned while we were playing 3D World. Not this, uh, 3D World. Also, this is not grass, this is cat fur. <laughs> we are walking on cat fur. Is it a 
started walking on sunshine. Uh, oh, built him. But 3D World spawned more new ideas than any other modern Mario game. And I feel like I can say that with confidence, because it not only spawned um, Toad Treasure Tractor, but it, it's spawning its own Mario game. Now. And, you know, they could have used Odyssey's engine or something like that, but they're actually just using, uh, you know, 3D World to make this. I feel like I... So the Rumble, they do make use of the HD Rumble on the Switch. And so I'm, I'm actually feeling things that I'm like, okay, maybe I should go over there, maybe I should go over here. So I'm coming up back here again because... Are we finding hidden cats? Anything that's cat-themed. We're find, find, finding anything that is cat-themed that usually isn't. So like, you know, the cat bell is usually cat -themed. Looks like Bowser Jr. has more to say. Whoa! It's a Gigabell! I heard a cool saying about these. I think it was when the beast rises, the Gigabell will ring or something. Maybe we gotta get this splotchy goop off first. Some more cat shines might do the trick. Alright. So he needs five. Yeah. So yeah, it's crazy that 3D World has become kind of this hub of modern Mario. Also, something that a lot of people have said and I thought was just a really cool idea, is that the big advancement that this game makes in just a Mario- <gasps> It's my favorite dudes! Oh, they're Captain now too. The biggest advancement that this game makes is that, as you noticed, when we enter a new island, it plays a different song. This is acting as the hub world as well as the levels. This is a fully open world Mario game where everything is on one map. This is the first time we're not loading into paintings, we're not loading into anything. We're just straight up going into the levels because they are all part of the world we're in. So that is the first time in a Mario game where we get them. We get just one seamless level. Wait, did I see something down there that I was like, oh... Oh yeah, I did. Our friendly enemies were... And now I'm guessing these guys, the boomerang guys, are also cat -bing. Okay. No cat boomerang guys. So that's another one. I don't need to pause for that. No! I did need to! Um... Oh, there's a secret there. So they mix the philosophies of what they had with Mario Odyssey and 3D World, where this they are still more compartmentalized. Um, no more. Well, I made a mistake. They are still more compartmentalized stages, but they're but they're more open-ended as well. So it kind of becomes a mix of what. We had last gen and this gen, which is an interesting mix. So it's like Odyssey mix with 3D World, essentially. So, yeah, I did think there was something to say. Oh. Send Bowser Jr. to investigate. Junior? <gasps> There's a cat shine. No Mario. Yeah, I probably need to be. Man, <laughs> I need to get better at these controls. But yeah, if you see any cat thing, tell me. I don't want to miss any of them. Oh, wait, wait, look at look at the little hieroglyphs. I like the, the second one, it looks like a derpy cat 
power. Like, <laughs> Also, the music is, ooh, deliciously Mario. Also, new Mario song. Uh-oh, started to rain. I don't know what that means. Soon, oh, oh, I feel, ooh, I feel like if this was a bigger world, oh no, more evil kitties, oh, I can only reach this, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, no, evil kitties, oh, so I guess maybe every time I'm close to, Ooh, I'm close to one of these cat shines. Bowser comes out. Oh, look at little Bowser Jr. I hadn't really noticed that. So yeah, it seems like every time I get close to one of the cat towers, Bowser comes out. I guess it's not as much about time, it's more about when I'm just releasing a power. Oh. oh! Hey! The lighthouse has some light news for you. Hey! Collecting coins can be worth your while. You'll get a power-up each time you collect 100 coins. You can store up to 5 of each power-up too. That's sure to come in handy during your adventure. Grab some coins and pocket a few extra power-ups. Didn't mean to do that. Oh, I didn't notice the lighthouse has a tail. <laughs> Mario! Hmm. The lighthouse has a tail. I'm a fire, Mario. Okay. Let's see. So... I like that this is way more exploratory. Obviously, right now I'm doing the more linear stuff, just going from island to island. But it does have way more. Ooh. Get here, get out of here, Goomba. There we go. Oh. I'm grab these coins. See, immediately they added value to the coins, but usually I wouldn't take care of oh, <laughs> It's very smart development, I'd say, too, because they're because they are reusing not only uh, 3D World's engine, but are, they're also reusing a lot of assets and stuff. So that's a smart way of making something creative without needing to. Oh, did I just miss a cat shine over there? I mean, a cat token, cat coin. It's too bad I can't do the quick swing in this that you can do in an Odyssey. Oh, I didn't actually go up here. This is the cat game we deserve. If I look for Bowser right now... Oh wow, the enemy stayed displaced. There's only one guy up there. That's kind of how I left. Where's Bowser? Oh wow, there's stuff far off into the distance. That's cool. That's really cool. Mario's swimming like a cat. This game. 
This game has too much cats. Or not enough for our account. We only found nine cat things. I really expected us to have found way more cat things by this point. <gasps> have those been changing every time I jump in the background? That's crazy. <laughs> And this is a smart little design thing I've been noticing too, just in the background. By giving us access... By giving us access to all the power-ups at any point, like they're doing, it means that they can make challenges that require specific ones at any point. So it's kind of like in... <gasps> Kitty! It's kind of like in... Uh, Odyssey, not Odyssey, sorry. In uh, Breath of the Wild, where they use all of the pads' uh, different abilities, and they they can use it at any point because they know you have it. So they don't have to rely on one power-up in Breath of the Wild like they used to in the old games because they give you everything up front, and then they just mix and match each of the cool powers coming up. So here, they're actually doing the same thing with this item system. They're just giving you all the items that you need up, like up front or not just up front but in uh, uh -oh. in great amount cat bullies that's number 10 are you gonna fall junior you, you messed up my count Good enough, right? Oh, my counter went off screen. Enough space here. Maybe I'll put it right. Can't count. Can't count. Uh. But yeah, I think this this is just a very smart little thing that allows them to do way more things gameplay wise because they. With all the, say, in 3D World, they can't expect you to have a specific power up unless they give it to you in the level. So they can't throw something new right at the beginning of the level. So they have a lot more limitation because of that. And that's not something they have to worry about because of, because of just this little thing that they did. Also, cat leaves among the wall leaves. Really? When the beast awakens, show, so shall I. They do? <gasps> they do! Nice catch. Nice catch. That's 11. Nice one. I didn't even see that. Okay. We're gonna, we're gonna have a bowser -y time. So before Bowser disappears, I actually want to find, because there's quite a few areas here that I'm seeing. There's a light hint from the light out. If you want to avoid the Beast's Fury Blast, find some cover if that can be. There are also special blocks on each island that can be broken only by Fury Blasts. Try to find them. When disaster strikes, they may be. That's what I was about to- Mario! Okay, the camera positioning for this is actually- I will complain about that. I don't like it. Here comes Bowser. Cat bell rings. Bell tolls for cat. No! I wanted that. Real bad. I guess I'll be coming back. Okay, so I'm gonna... Where's Bowser? Yeah, I want you to burn these. There we go. See, that's a cool... Oh, and they don't show you. They don't show you the... the total amount you can get on the island. The cat bombs? I did count the trees, but cat bombs? <gasps> okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
can do. Thank you! Cat bond. You mean the bushes? That's another cat shine. Oh, and you see they show up maybe in the order that you could have gotten them. Oh! Are you seeing that? So the- I didn't even notice that the buttons on the lighthouse are, are the amount that you have. That's cool. So each of them could have possibly five, depending maybe some of them have more. That's cool. There's just so many little details that kind of give you a, a clue to what you're... to what you can expect. It's very interesting. Wait, did Mario just run on the water? Can I... Shell. <laughs> How do I stop this? Interesting. Okay. That's a new way to use it. That's a new way to use it. Oh, we're, we already have the Mac. So this actually makes it quite easy to travel around the island. Oh, so each island has five, five shines. So like, it's not just this area that we have open, all of the, this conglomerate of islands, but each sing, every single island has five. That's a lot. I need to get a closer look at that one. Wait, are they furry? They're furry. <laughs> what was my picture? Look at that. <laughs> They're furry. So. <laughs> oh. Oh, yeah, the bullies? Yes, yes, I did. I did count the bullies. Uh, can we get up there? Oh. I need my cat. The music bobs. I know I say that a lot. Well, I guess I've only been singing it to Mark. Mark game's actually having double music. <laughs> so. But this. And it's interesting that now I'm coming back up here. They're different. They have a different set of. Oh, they have a different set of. Ah! Oh, I'm carrying it! I'm carrying the kitten! Oh, can I use it to attack? Okay, I have to test this. I have to test this. Uh oh. Oh, I can use cats to attack! <laughs> okay, I need to find my next Bowser thingy that I want. This. So I'm actually gonna use this. Where's that? There he is. Alright. Okay, so it comes... The fear, my fear is that we won't see Bowser again on these islands after I use that. Come on, hit me. Hit me! Look at all the money! There's a lot of collectibles here. There's a lot of collectibles here. <laughs> this game is... So this game is a bit of a trap. <laughs> a very good trap. There's a lot of collectibles. <laughs> I, 
I I feel like I'm not even scratching the. Oh, I do. <gasps> I feel like I'm not even scratching the surface, but... Okay, so I know that now I saw it from a distance. To get up there, I need to wait for Bowser. Because Bowser hits... Uh, when Bowser hits, he actually makes platforms over there. Okay. Oh, there's some new stuff over there. So, is does every time I leave an area, more stuff show up? Cause that's crazy. <laughs> like this. This wasn't here the last time I came over. Challenges? It's so very. <laughs> I mean, it's like a Mario game. It's the lighthouse wants to shed some light on something. Do you know about? I do. I've been looking at many things. <laughs> uh, I. Yeah, I mean, this is. I was thinking maybe this would be a very shallow experience, so it might be shorter than the full Mario game, but it's not a shallow experience at all. I would not, <laughs> in any moment, describe it as that, especially after already experiencing as much as I have in such a short amount of time. Count cat bird with long neck? Got, got it. I've counted my buddies here, which is still, I think, my favorite enemy in 3D World. I love these guys. <laughs> so I already have 10 catch up. But it's actually... I don't find it as much of a bother. I was seeing a lot of people saying that the frequency in which Bowser shows up is kind of annoying. But I, so far I'm actually okay with it because there's multiple things I want to do when Bowser's here. Like, there are plenty of little secrets or things that I want to do and, like, have Bowser open up for me. So far, I have another one over here that I want to open up. Uh, I know that he's probably not coming up soon, but this over here... This is kind of tricky, because right at the moment he shoots, you gotta jump up and do this. Man, the music is just so joyful, it just makes me want to bop. climb on top of- Get out of here, bird! I'm gonna go! Is he not wall slide? Not on this, I guess. There's still so much more- okay. That dude is... That dude's about to... Okay. Pounce Isle. I have three out of five. But I can still... Especially since I'm, I'm trying to stay a little bit long. I can definitely look for me. Okay. How is this one different? Position? They really want me to do it, but I really want to give up the secret! <laughs> In Odyssey, when I was playing Odyssey, I got all 900 and whatever moon. I couldn't not. <laughs> Alright, Bowser. Hit me! Did I do it? Hey! I couldn't not get all night. <laughs> That's why I love 64. I love Sunshine. I love Odyssey. It's just because you keep going and you keep getting more. And it's just like... Alright, next time he shows up, I'm, I'm getting the big bell. 
so ever we can all see what it does. I'm actually really excited. I know what it does, but I don't know exactly how it's gonna work. And that's kind of the exciting part for me. Uh, if you have not seen it, do not look it up. It's coming up next. Uh, it's quite exciting. <laughs> to say the least. Okay, so I'm missing one cat coin in this world. So I'm missing one cat coin somewhere. Alright! You guys see the cat coin? Yeah, I guess it didn't really explore this part very closely. No, that's not showing the cat coins. I completed cat coins for this, but I am missing one from this island. I don't know where it could be. And the music transitions so seamlessly. I mean, that's that's just something video games do very well. And I go here, and this has its own set of. Oh, here we go! The last time we were here, this wasn't up. This wasn't here. Let's see. Are the bees cats? Oh, that's... Given the prize that they give you. Are the bees cats? I didn't... I didn't notice if they were. They are. Okay. We gotta add that to the list. creatures. And there's that island back in the distance. What's that? I wonder if defeating all the, the bee creatures. The bee cats. Oh, here we go. I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do the big bell now. So everyone can enjoy the power of the super bell. Or a great bell. Like sight Giga Bell. There we go. I guess Giga Bowser, Giga Bell at work. Oh, the little pedestal is a little cat. I didn't notice it, so the bell's like the head of the cat. Yeah. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Let's enjoy this. Let's see what this is all about. So cool! Oh wow, they even need a load. Come here, Bowser. Ooh, ooh! Oh no, in muck, I can't. Uh oh. Ooh! 
Get back, Bowser. Oh, oh. Oh, is he gonna burst? <laughs> it looked like it was about a burst. <laughs> like an A. <laughs> that would be freaky. <laughs> okay, cat rainbow. <laughs> That's a cool sprite. And again, all the levels in one place. You don't need to load. You don't need to do anything. Hello to our ice level. Looks like Bowser Jr. has more, more sink. He sank back into the lake. But trust me, it'll take more than that to beat my papa. We need to make him really see the light. The way to do it, that is to find more cat time. More of that splotchy stuff went away, so there must be new islands to explore. Let's check on the map. Get going. Hurry up, Mario. Oh, wow. That's a big section. We just opened up a big section. And that's the crazy thing. That little small section had all of those moons, so... Oh, he has more to say. Oh, yeah. I almost forgot something important. If you get lost... Just press minus or the side and bring him in. Look, it's Plessy. <gasps> new cat, new cat. Calico? Hello. What's your deal, little Calico cat? Oh, cat doesn't like Mark. <gasps> Sad cat mama. What's up? Oh, you want me to bring- this is like the penguins. <laughs> We're gonna start throwing these cats off of everything. Hello, mama! Look who I brought to you! Oh. Yes! Lost kitten by the shore. Are the cheap cheap's cats? Of course. Of course they are. Why wouldn't the cheap cheap's be- why wouldn't the fish be cat? Oh, there's some new stuff here. Again, they keep adding new stuff. No, my nightmare, Shadow Luigi. <laughs> what do I do to Shadow Luigi? Um. It couldn't be more nightmarish than this for me. <laughs> Hates Luigi. Gets to see nightmare shadow Luigi. Get him! Get him, cats! Of course it's shadow Luigi. I guess they really... Nintendo <laughs> really got the message. They knew I hated Luigi. Catfish. Oh! <laughs> Catfish. See what you did there. See what you did there. That's not gonna work. There's a whole path over there. Okay, I'm gonna... Ah, there's so much to do! <laughs> it's getting my... My inner Mario anxiety. <laughs> I just want to do everything. Also, that's something I also heard people really enjoyed. Plessy just shows up everywhere. So you never feel like... Do I need to say what this song... Is <laughs> do I need to sh say anything more than it's a bop? <laughs> it's totally good. Plus, you're going on land. <laughs> Plus, how do I do this now? Okay. Ooh. Oh. 
And it feels solid like any Mario platformer does. Like, it feels very solid. Look at these guys chilling. I actually really love that. Thanks, Blessy. I love that they're just chilling in the water. <laughs> they're just like, oh, yeah. Yeah, <gasps> they don't know how to swim. Goombas never learn how to swim. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can tell, I'm just on overload mode. I'm really just loving everything. <laughs> do we count that as a different fire flower? I guess we do. We always count that as a different fire flower. Oh, I, di I didn't know if we had a, a time limit. Because that's a fire fire flower. That's a different fire flower. It's a normal fire. I mean, piranha plant. Hey, team! Cold Cove Combat. A message is ringing out from the Giga Bell. When the beast awakens, so shall. Oh, wow, we already have enough. That's what happens whenever I play a Mario game. I reach the goal. I need to reach the goal uh, way before <laughs> I need to, just because I'm just like, oh, I gotta click. Oh. Any more cat related things? Oh, the rocks are cat themed. Slip skate slope. <gasps> oh no. Oh there. Thank you. Keep giving me the boot. Yes. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh wow, this is cool. Ooh, no, 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 no. no! Oh, I need to count down. Oh, that was closing in. Ooh! My depth perception. No! Mario! <laughs> That's fun. See, they're incorporating all of the different Mario level styles into one world. They're finding a way to make them all fit and work seamless seamlessly. Lighthouse has a light suggestion for you. If you've saved up, you yes, you know. Yes. Oh, I didn't know. Cat mouse. Yes, thank you. Cat mouse. Cat mouse. Cat Mouse. Did anyone watch Cat Dog back in the day? It used to be a favorite of mine. Actually, no, I didn't actually really like it. I I watched it because when you're a kid, you just watch. Especially before, you know, kids nowadays will never understand having to wait or just watch what's on. Because back in my day, I just had to watch whatever was on. I couldn't choose. Oh, I didn't see any Bowser tiles yet. Oh wow, where's this table? What's up with these bells? Uh-oh. Not in a good position for this. I'm not in a good position. Yeah, those Nick Nickelodeon cartoons were weird. Those early Nickelodeon cartoons. They were always weird. You, were you, you guys hear my ne neck? Oh, oh, look at that. Cool. 
What? <laughs> That's what that does? <laughs> uh oh. I want that catch up. Gimme. No! I don't see any Bowser tiles. Oh, there's stuff on top, too. Go on the side. Oh, no! Alright. I gotta find... I gotta find a way to deal with Bowser, too. Uh-oh. What's that? What's he doing? He just leaving? I thought I, I thought you were gonna stick around until until Oh there there Koopa's with a C Oh they're first Are you gonna swim buddy? No, you just gave up. <laughs> There's not to say. Been seeing a lot of swimming related. Oh, Plessy isn't a cat. Oh, feel vibration. Plessy. Oh. Let's miss all the coins together. <gasps> Those are cats. Those bleepies, or whatever they're called. The bleepy bloops. <laughs> you know. The music for Plessy is fantastic. I love it. I think it's so far my favorite song. Oh. Okay. My favorite song in the game so far. Under Baby. we do this an agent of chaos watches he knows too is he turning towards me he knows too much he knows everyone <laughs> all right so i know that there's a there's a cloud there i think i destroyed one of the trees Oh no, I did. See, this is if you if you've been watching. Oh yeah, I need to put these guys in. Oh my god, theme. You know that like those clouds. So going back to what I was saying, if you've been watching me play 3D World, you know that the clouds they do. Bowser Jr., go do my dirty work. There we go. <laughs> Useful. Oh, yes. No, did I add them? I forgot if I added, added them. I think 20 to 21 was, was those little beepy bops. Or am I mistaken? Oh, no. I'm getting my cat scooch. Oh, there's a secret. This game is the best and the worst for my <laughs> ADHD. I just... I'm just like, okay, this... Oh, this one. <laughs> what are those in the distance? Oh. 
I'm gonna do whatever this is, but <laughs> see what I mean? <laughs> Are we timed? Is this on a timer? Please put it on a timer. Yes! I like a challenge. Give me. Cat hieroglyphs? Yeah, I did see those, but I don't know. Should I count those? Because, like, those aren't like, a version of something that exists in Mario World that isn't, like, cat hieroglyphs just exist. That's why I wasn't sure if I should add that one or not. I was a bit like, hmm. Uh-oh. Here. There's just a bell in there. The middle. The mail on my back just became a cat. Thanks, Plessy. I'm gonna actually open two things for this one go about. Come on, Bowser. Get me. Yeah, I don't know. What do you think? Do you think it should be counted, or, or no? Because I, I was, I was in between. I was like, hmm, I don't know if I should count the cat hieroglyphs, or if they. Or if they're, they're just like, they're not, they're cat themed, but it's not like they're a cat version of something something that already has like I counted these because we do see like these kind of things in a lot of Mario games these, like little edge blocks like castle edge blocks but these which we usually see have them so I counted that but okay, what's the deal with this oh, oh. what is this new contraption <laughs> I found the other cat Kitty. Come on, little kitty. No! I killed it! Aw, BB. Go to sleep. Is he watching the stream? Don't let him watch the stream, he'll get super awake. Bowser, can I turn you off, Bowser? You're, you're helping me a little bit too. Because I was gonna jump on these, Bowser. Now I can't. Because you took them away. Bowser. Junior. Hmm. <laughs> Make me happy. Claw Swipe Coliseum. Okay, so I know we can get in the... Now we can get get into the Coliseum. Yeah. What's the deal with it? Cat Boom Boom. Can Cat Mario climb on the edge now? Ooh, I like the shine that Boom Boom has on his on his shell. Look at that. It looks really good. I guess so far, I guess the only thing I would say is that I wish... And that's not usually a big thing with Mario, but I, so far a lot of the enemies we've seen are just 3D world enemies with cat ears. And I wish 
maybe because in a lot of times Mario games they always have the same is that a mega bunny they always have the same enemies but they're used in new ways or placed in very nice ways but like boom boom feels like because he's kind of like a mini boss especially early on Mario had very creative mini bosses like think even even as bosses like all the the Koopa kids and then in Super Mario World you had like Reznor the the Triceratops guys that kept coming back uh, they were super fun to fight against because they were difficult they were creative obviously they did reuse them a couple times within that same game but they would add interesting twists on it so I just wish that of all the um to get to another another Bowser pile. Of all the the things that they kept, I wish they wouldn't have kept. Um, probably one of the easiest bosses in Mario history, which is Boom Boom. Uh, where, where, where is Bowser? Okay, we're going Giga. We're going Giga. Come on, Bowser. If this doesn't have a star in it, we're going Giga. Oh! Oh! So this does have a cat giant. So we'll Giga up next time. Oh, he has a way bigger pot how far. One thing that has always bothered me in games, though, is water texture. You see how you can see the pattern in the water? That always gets me. I feel like some games do a good job of you not being able to see them. But so many games... I remember a modern game... Uh, I thought had the worst of this was um, Metal Gear Solid 5. It looked so bad. I it really I really didn't like it. <laughs> it I feel like no. I feel like they want me to use that for something. This. Where can we flick? How far will will you flick? Bummer. Oh, that didn't last very long. I was gonna. Plessy. Hopefully, are the fish reset? No. So the the persistence of things are actually is actually very surprising. Like things don't respawn. That pom pom power attacks. That pom pom's counter attacks. Oh, that bunny. I think I know what I need to catch that bunny. Is that bunny a cat? I'm having to do claw grab. Where's the bunny? I'm gonna have to do claw grab for this. Come on, bunny! This is not a, a cat bunny. Yep. Yep. 
Well, that looks cool. Is that, a, is that a golden mush? No, it's a golden shell. Oh, we're gonna have some fun. You can see the goal of this area. What about how fun? Coin Frenzy Bowser. Um... Plessy? Plessy, oh. let's go. Was super satisfying. <laughs> yeah, this is like this feels like an Odyssey DLC more than a 3D World DLC. Obviously, mechanics-wise, is more like 3D World, but the pacing of this is so Odyssey. -y. It's so Odyssey. -y. All right, next time he shows up, I will. Now this time, 100%, I will use. Is this a new song. Lighthouse just had a bright idea. Have you tried using Amiibo? <laughs> if you hold blah, cause special things to happen. I wonder if my snake Amiibo can do anything. That's the only Amiibo I have on me. My snake Amiibo. But I doubt that one is gonna do anything. This was a mechanic they explored in one level or a couple levels in 3D World, but now actually making a full world out of it. That's actually really cool. Oh. <gasps> What's his name? Globo or whatever? Or Glo Glooby? These guys have a name. He's Cat Beam. The Gloobies. Full island, just of invisible. And if, as a fan of hexagonal design, I feel pretty confident. Uh oh, the secret. Oh, 
Alright! This time I uh, but I didn't want to get to the top of this island, I guess. Alright. What in the world is that island just moving on its own? Okay, we gotta get to the Giga Bell. Because I'm doing Giga Bell right now. Time to go Super Saiyan. Super Saiyan Mario. Let's go. Let's -a go. Crazy that Giga Mario is so heavy that it requires his, his own cutscene. I mean, uh, bring it on, that Whoa, whoa! How am I gonna hit him? I'm normal Mario now. Do I grab his tail? <laughs> That's all I know how to do. Oh, I get I get another Giga Bell. Come on, come on. Meow meow. No! That's all the bells I have. Oh no, they respawn. Okay, good, 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 good. No! Stop doing that, Bowser. <laughs> This music, though, that's... Wow, he's so much bigger than... <laughs> okay, okay, this is where I get him. Is he gonna fall? Yeah, sucker. I'm out of cat. I got you. Ooh, that was close. Get it, get it, Mario. Get it, get it. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> oh, you're not gonna get me. Yeah! Gotcha. <laughs> is there a choir in the background? Yes, there is. There is a choir. <laughs> it's super epic. It is like, if you love kaiju stuff, this is the game for you. I don't think there is a good Godzilla game, so if you love Godzilla, get this game. That's fun. That's fun. A new sprite. That's a fun one. <laughs> ah! Can't believe he ran away again! I mean, uh, Dad is the best of everything. Of course he knows when it's time to retreat. <laughs> this Giga Bell is all splotchy again. We need more cat shots. Maybe we'll find some hiding in the islands we've already visited. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, I mean, there are a ton. How many more do I need for this one? I think I might already have what I need. Like, there's a, a windmill island I haven't even been to. Like, I'm still doing- Yeah, there's a windmill island over there. 
I'm still doing the Coliseum. I never finished the Coliseum. Oh, I can do the cat now. Now oh, that baby Bowser is not going to annoy me while I do this. Okay, switching. All right, all right. All right. Now for some expertly timed jumps. No! <laughs> said mama one more kitty you gotta find one more kitty if it's on the farthest island though that's that's gonna be quite the chore to bring the kitty back all right I'm gonna enter the Coliseum one more time I feel like I keep getting distracted by this game <laughs> I don't wait where's he It wasn't this far back, was it? Yeah, the entrance disappeared! What? Is the water level rising? Secret down there. They just leave. The cat power up is so good, though. That's the thing. The cat power up kind of renders most other power ups kind of useless. Unless you need to use them for something specific. Most of the other ones are kind of trash. Because <laughs> cat power up is so good. By the way, while, also while we're playing this, uh, I don't think that this is going to be a very long playthrough by any means. Um, I did want to ask all of you, what games would you be interested in seeing me play next? Now that that's a very broad question, but I just want to gauge. I can't promise I will play them because, number one, I need to have them, but I want to... It's more for getting an idea of, like, what you guys like, what type of stuff... Uh, you're into watching, maybe, yeah, it might not be something you, per se, like to play, but just something you tend to enjoy more to watch. I'm just curious. Hmm. I don't know if there's much more I can do here. Do the boss battle. I think I've done everything at the Coliseum. I guess I'm moving, but I've only gotten one of the five shines in the Coliseum I <laughs> Which is like... One thing that's interesting in this is that you can't see the bot- Oh! Hello, Webkins! <laughs> yes. And I think that will definitely be something. That will definitely be something that will be coming up. I'm kind of thinking about like how exactly I'm gonna do th that one and if it is just gonna be Webkins or if I am gonna do some of the other ones as well. Is this the same battle? Oh, it's a different battle. And how you doing, Ash? Good to see you. Happy Friday, everyone. It's too bad that these battles are just recycled. From 3D World. Oh, 
How's your day been? That's good. Just chillin'. Oh, heard a weird cooking. So we're missing one coin. As a recap for anyone coming in, this is the new Mario game, uh, Bowser's Fury, that uses kind of the same engine that the last Mario game I was playing, but it kind of uses it in a completely new format, where everything is in one world. You don't go into paintings or levels, everything is just open to you. So it's essentially the first open world Mario game. Like, proper open world. Look at that catch up. Oh, oh, it's this one. <laughs> okay, um... I don't know if I have time to do that with Bowser kind of up in the sky right now. Actually, be able. <laughs> you having trouble there, Erica? <laughs> oh. Here we go, here we go. Maybe I might be able to beat him this time. Here we go. I think we might be able to do it this time. Got a half bar, Bowser. What you gonna do? Oh, new attacks, new attacks. Need to be on his belly side. Come on, come on. Spin again? No, he's doing it. Almost. Ah! Get out of the group, Bowser. Yes! <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I am sorry, Erica. And it's pretty late, too. Did he have a nap? Napo. It looks like the... The cat ring. Actually, a lot of the cat designs look like the the bongo cat. <laughs> kind of the silhouette of the the bongo. Cat. I thought warm milk was supposed to make you sleepy. Oh. Oh. 
fire level. Fire... Cat Mountain. I think that counts. Usually mountains aren't cats. <laughs> ah, nuts! I really hope he would king back this time. I mean, uh, uh, of course he did. Nobody shrugs off a hit from Mario better than my papa, after all. Come on, let's find a way up that waterfall and look more for cat shines. Oh, we finished opening up the island. So, I guess we have all of it open. 40? The next one is 40? Alright, so I guess we're not <laughs> we're not doing cat cat fights until we get to 40. There's still so much I haven't done. That's crazy. Like, I, I'm just... I feel like I'm still just scr scratching the surface here. So let's actually do this one. We've been dancing around the invisible one. But what's the deal with this moving island? It keeps going away. Well, I'm fully loaded on all the... All the power-ups. They're just expanding on the exploration of these things that, like, again, we saw at one level before, and now we're getting to see, like, a full mini-world of just these things. Here we go! Also, chest bust. Buster? I guess I need to climb up. Get the shine. Go with the flow away. Right. We opened that world and we haven't even explored this yet. It's flying. I guess this is Flight World? I guess it's still hot. Oh, look at where the third cat is. How am I gonna bring this cat home? <laughs> I didn't expect me to bring this cat. Okay, can I go to Plessy for this cat? Because otherwise, I don't think... No, I just threw the cat! <laughs> I just threw the cat! Okay. When are you gonna bring the cat back? Are you kidding? I have to get the floating islands? Okay. Ooh, I like the... No music. Also, these flippers or whatever. They're cat. I'm surprised that the snowballs are cats at this point. Oh, the posts are cats. 
Ooh. Wait, was it 25 or was it 24? Should it be 26 now? Uh-oh. I don't know if I just retyped 25 on it. <laughs> did it very absent-mindedly. This has a very Tim Burton-esque kind of feel to it. Ooh. Or, I guess, Danny Elfman kind of thing. Danny Elfman is the dude who always does. I love how it's almost like a, a ballet. Might have been what they were going for. Oh no. Oh. Oh! Oh, I just saw a cat thing. Okay, I'm actually, hmm. I'm going to get to the top, and I'm going to stop, and I'm going to go play some Bell Hunter. Because otherwise, I could just get stuck on this <laughs> forever. I am really enjoying it. Uh-oh, uh-oh. I'm gonna get to the top and get the shine up top. And that will be it for Bowser's Fury. Bowser's Fury is immediately, in my opinion, much better than for you. 3D world felt a little bit stale for me. But this is immediately way more interesting. I love the new ideas that it's bringing. I love the... And that's not to say that I think 3D world is bad at all. Right? It's just... That it... Even in the new things it brought, and in the creative levels, it was still more Mario, and not, and that's never a complaint, really, but it's, like, sometimes you do want to see something that is different and creative, and this game is actually bringing a lot of bigger ideas to Mario. While the enemies are the same, they're doing so many other things that are far more interesting. Let's get our lighthouse tip, and that will be it for the night. Lighthouse has one final tip. Oh! Oh, this is the final tip. Have you checked the guides? They'll show you how to perform special actions, offer useful information, and teach basic info about how to play. Uh, that's all the lighthouses have to say. Thanks for listening. They hope they help. You did. I wonder. I wonder if there's anything. Spin move, crouch jump, yeah, ground pound, ground pound jump, long jump roll, long rolling jump, midair roll, side somersault. Side somersault nowadays is way harder to do. It was easier to do it in Odyssey, but like this one and the last one and uh, 3D World. Kind of complicated. Alright. So that 
is a little bit of Bowser's Fury. This was a... This game is a blast. <laughs> it is, at least to me, way more exciting than... than uh, 3D World was. It, it really gives me Odyssey vibes, and I am okay with that. Because... <laughs> Odyssey, if anything is going for an Odyssey type thing, you know, more power to them. As, hey, it's not easy to pull off well, and to do it all in one world like this is even, even more difficult on a technical aspect as well. So, props to this game. So this is going to be it for this game today, and I am going to swap into some Val Valva. See what we can do there. But I will be right back. This should be a maybe a two to three, maybe up to five minute break. So I will see you all soon.